Shapes and Angles Kushi has six sticks and she is making shapes with it. Look, she could make many shapes with six sticks. All the shapes are closed shapes and has six sides. Then, why are they different? Look carefully. She just rotated few sticks to transform one shape to another shape. Means, there are six sides of same length, but the difference in angle between those sides caused all the difference. Let us examine these two shapes. All the angles are equal except the angles marked in red. Those two angles changed and we got a completely different shape. Now, let us see the angles which we can make between two sticks to get a close shape. As we open this book, notice how the angle between two sides changes. This is acute angle which is less than right angle. And this is right angle, one side standing straight on another side. After right angle, we get obtuse angle. We keep opening the book and two sides ended up in same line. Now the angle between them is a straight angle which is double of right angle. Acute angle, right angle and obtuse angle are most common in closed shapes. We cannot get straight angle in a closed shape. If both sides are on same line, we can consider them one line only. Now, properties of angles are different in different shape. Like, these two shapes have equal sides. But in first shapes, all angles are equal. In second shape, opposite angles are equal. In few shapes, sum of all angles is equal. Hence, when one angle reduces, one or more angle increases to compensate for that. Thus, the shape transforms into some new shape. We see angles everywhere. Buildings make right angle with ground as those are standing straight. Leaning Tower of Pisa is making acute angle with ground as it is leaning towards ground. There are angles between two hands of clock. Slanting plane used to move things up like ramp make angle. There are angles is design. Can you recognize these angles around you? Go and explore. Bye-bye.